Hey everybody, what's happening to Shadowcast? Welcome back to more Pokemon Reborn. Last time, we've discovered the Lapis Ward's um, Black Market, the 7th Street. This time, oh god, we're close to something I'm going to dread. By the way, this guy sell you see ability capsules at random points or at random amounts of shards. Our goal right now is to not fight this guy. Dude, I'm so budging leveled right now. Fight me. Both Noble and Smoke leveled up. By the way, if you ever want to heal, there's a healing table over there in case you didn't know. Right here, more moves can be learned. In here, there's nothing of interest. Because I went through the wrong hole. One down there causes it's a fight. You have to navigate this place fairly well if you want to possibly find anything. Oh, and another battle. Oops. Dude, the Butterfree are so, like, lackadaisical. They totally just morphed into that beam. Okay, that fight's done. Now we want to come down here and we have to deal with another person. Or not. I thought we did. This lady talking about boyfriend selling people, selling people, selling things. This guy is a junk dealer. He'll sell various random things, including an oval stone, which you can get from digging, quick powder for ditto, sticky barbs, charcoal, which I do think I want to pick one up, sticky barb, and if we were still using Pikachu, a light bulb, which is pretty useful. A soul candle, which can be used for some Pokemon. Float stone has Pokemon's weight. Binding band increases length of binding moves. Now, there's nothing there that can help you. Weird guy, we're under around Mokyo. Junk dealer. This guy down here is that junk dealer mentioned. Blah blah blah. Kid had green all over him in more ways than one. I'm going to turn down the game's volume because, let's be honest, it's probably downing my voice pretty well. I'm also going to turn down my own volume so I don't have to hear it so loud. Jeebus. I dipped him good. Kid had a green all over him in more ways than one. Anyway, you just miss him. He's probably around here somewhere though. Maybe ask around. Someone's bound to notice. Well, no, someone like him anyway. That said, buy some! Spare candy, ha. Huh? Locked. Locked. We can't get into either of those doors. We don't have access to any items to help us search yet. Can't get anything from you. As for the Pierce here. Water and hole right here. This over here is the water and hole mentioned. Clearly doesn't look like anyone's there. No wait, this is the water hole mentioned. And the next thing here, there's a Bennett, and he goes this way. Now he's in here. I had a feeling you were following me. But of all people, I never expected to see you down here, Shad. Then again, I suppose this isn't the sort of place someone like me would choose to be either. I was asked to go get some supply, blah, blah, some supplies for our rituals, so it couldn't be helped. Of course, they would cross with the cross with me if someone followed me back. So, but I must return post haste so we can save Luna. Oh, you're trying to save Luna? I see. Well, in that case, there should be no problem. We have the same goal. I'm sure they'll go understand that. The entrance to our chamber is actually uh, hidden, hidden down here, but I'll go ahead and leave the way open for you. It's just right outside, you can't miss it. And as you can see, the path opens. However, we don't want to do that quite yet. Reason being, as soon as you make it a certain length down there, you cannot come back until after you finish with that. And that is the thing I am dreading. I believe I said there was a certain part of this game that was my least favorite part. Well... When I said that, I believe I was mistaken. What's coming up is my absolute most hated area in this game, period. We're going to see why shortly. 
But for now, we need to wreck some angry birds. Play him charge by accident, but that still did half health. Ow. I don't know why I'm showing this battle, but it's too late now. I've already gone through it all. Okay, we have no reason to stop and talk to him. We want to quickly heal up once again, like I always do. We have several ability capsules that we can use if need be. In fact, I should probably check everyone's abilities, huh? You have Poison Point, that's good, even though you'd be better with Technician. You have Rivalry, that's excellent. Telepathy, you're good for double battles. Super Luck, that is perfect for your moveset. Somehow you've been KOing mostly special attack Pokemon, but we'll be able to reset IVs later on to redo that. You have Water Absorb, that is perfect. Flash Fire, which is also perfect. Okay, we don't need to use our ability capsule set. Before we go into that area mentioned, we want to come here. This guy here will fight us. But he only had a Bastion, which is down already. And Renia got a free level from that. This guy looked familiar. We're going to want Quagsire in the lead for this, I think. Chad, right? And... He used to be the king of the jungle called Reborn City. Until you showed up and dethroned me. Magma Gang's no more. That's your fault. Here I am, alone in this stuff. That's your fault too. There's no glory in this. But... I've been waiting for this. I'd hope to see you again, because it's time for me to reclaim my fame. Let's do this, Shad. What glory, baby? Battle 2 against Kingpin... What's his face? He opens with the Ninetales. We want to... Try to counter with Quagsire here. Of course, you just got burned, so that's an issue. Let's stop that burn before it gets too terribly bad, huh? Heal up. Extra sensory, that's gonna hurt. But we're still alive. Now we want to use a Moo Moo Milk. Now, keep more. I think it's faster. Yep. Bike Sire down. That's fine. Noble should be able to handle a lot of these two. This isn't a required battle at all, but it's still important somewhat. Oh, I shouldn't have had you out for this, huh? Okay, smoke. Thank you for the free fire. Rock Smash isn't going to do that much, but it can at least lower its defenses. Once. We need to heal now. At least try. I like the music for this fight, though. Okay, now we gotta at least... No, we weakened its defense enough, so someone else can handle this. Now someone else being Pandora! Except it's faster. Oh well. That was a crit. Well, that's a slight issue, uh, okay. And it's down. Surprise Noble's faster of all the Pokemon. Next is his Ninetales again. Earth Power, Ninetales down. Next is Sound Doom. Almost. Fortunately, this might just take down Noble. Dang it! If you're faster, I can try. Problem is, I don't want to lose this. I don't want to lose any of these fights, really. I'll be right back. Grr. Okay, it might not be going off the deep end a little. Again, I had to be a button cheat. Shame. But the Houndoom is defeated. 
He has one more Pokemon, a Pyvar. Might be a little difficult to deal with. But we got this. We want to heal up real quick. Just one more. That should tide us over. You missed. You're dead. Kingpin Maxwell defeated. Still? Back up, hold on. Time out, redo. No, I still can't. Man, what's it take to beat you? Cheat codes? I've been lingering around here in a desperate hope that if I beat you, I could rebuild my family. It seems that won't happen. Maybe it's time to move on for glory. Take up a factory job and live a real life or something. I've been wasting all my time all along. That's humiliating. Whatever, take this. Parting gift from a dying man. TM11, sunny day. What you would receive from Maxwell if we had sided with him with Team Magma beforehand. You would receive rain dance from Archer here instead. I'll die here, and I'll be reborn a normal person. Thank you. In the end, Glory was a prison. Dude, way to ruin the moment! And I accidentally ran into an aqua gun. Dang, grunt. Guess who's gonna die? I don't know how I survived that fight. But I was going to heal up my Pokemon when I ran into him. It wasn't intentional at all. Now, we're going to go do that thing which I dread. We go through this door, decide there's a rock. Well, that didn't go well at all. But guess what? We have Blast Powder now. Round two, baby. Unfortunately, I have lost my every way to pass the meat now. Except clicking on there, you get one rare candy in quotation marks. What is a rare candy, you might ask? Rare candy infused with hallucinogenic com components. Let's not use this. Alright, I suppose we can't put it off any longer. Just hoping there'd be an item there to let me. You see another ruin-like place here. This here is the sole reason why I didn't feel like one or why I wouldn't have wanted to do this let's play. Sorry about this, Shad. That is, Elias actually asked me to let you in here. But you actually thought I was that dumb, didn't you? The figures, most people seem to not think very highly of me. Which, I suppose, is typical of a person who prefers the company of bugs to that of people. Ah, do not mistake my dif or do not mistake my standoffishness, shall we say, for any personal disdain. I'm merely doing what is best for Luna's future, and mine. You have done well, Bennett. Continue your, your diligence and I will surely secure a position in Elite Four for you. Yes, of course. Thank you, sir. Although I originally intended only to ask his help in finding Luna, Bennett has proven a surprisingly useful assistant. Naturally, I want to help Luna as much as you do, sir. As such, we shall begin her purification ritual post-haste. Until then, please see that Shad is confined safely in the dungeon. We shall deal with that annoyance later. We will eradicate any memory Luna has of that swine, Radimus. And she will remember where her loyalties lie and return to the light. Yes, well, Shad, if you would follow me, not that you may have much of a choice given our numbers. We're locked in prison. You see a guy over there? We kind of have to read this in order to continue. We have to remember what these books say. Is that some pages I hear turning over there? Howdy friend, name's Randall, How you, how's you? You know, they keep me down here for a few days, but I actually don't mind. I mean, at least they feeding us, right? I get better food in the cell than I did on the streets. Not that 
Not that that's saying much, but I can't rightly say I'm hating it. They kind enough to give us some educational reading, too. Don't do me much difference, even if it's is all a bunch of religionous heebie-jeebie. Keeps me from getting bored and going back to the candy. Ah, that ain't neither here nor there. I figure I'll just enjoy their hospitality. Hospitabil... <clears throat> Hospit... Abatality. For a few days while I detox, then head right on out. Them guards ain't listening, rightly? See, truth be told, I could let myself out of here whenever I want. Wanna see why? Come on out, buddy. Good work, buddy. See, Klefki here just sort of happened to pick up some of that what is a sort of master key to this place. Mighty lucky that one, huh? I'll just scoot on now whenever I get bored, but I imagine you is more interested in escaping me, so there you go, partner. Oh hey, if you're planning on running out, there's a couple stuff you ought to know. Firstly, there's a muckload of people patrolling four bowers. I'd recommend not trying to fight them all yourself, probably best to just sneak and rat past them. But if you get caught again, my buddy's got your back. Secondly, personal recommendation, if you see any books lying out and about, I might want to check them out. I mean, some of them... Some of these are pretty fucking funny. Arceus will save us all, Shaw is a Pokemon. These guys is nuts. It's great. Anyway, go knock yourself out. So, welcome to something that I'm going to turn off fast forward for, despite how slow it is. Meat, still segment. There is no escape from the eyes of the Lord. And unfortunately, this is mandatory. Normally you'd also have to sneak around and collect or and memorize what certain books say in these libraries here. Also there's spell tag, and you have to click each indi individual book in order to read each individual one but only four of the things will be useful. Now, it's best to save every chance you get in case you get far and struggle continuing on. As you can see, this way, pretty straightforward. You want to go straight south, run down here behind this guy, head north and go here and straight down. Now, this isn't the way you're supposed to go, as that guy will catch you instantly. What you really want to do is come over here and go down. Then, once behind him, you want to turn this way, and you have to make a straight beeline for the north when this guy is not looking. If you fail, you get caught again. Be right back. And I'm back, but this time I'm going to save beforehand because I'm probably going to get caught again. See? Luckily we have a backup plan. But you guys probably want to see me keep failing, huh? Well, it's too bad I made it past... Damn it. I just had to say that, didn't I? Whoops. See? Problem is, as soon as you get caught at all, you're sent all the way back to the beginning. It's a typical cell segment. However, some of these you have pretty much no window of opportunity for mistake. If you make one misstep, excuse me for not turning off fast forward, properly anyway, one misstep and you get caught. Fun, isn't it? Look at that. Caught again. I'll be right back as soon as I get past this guy and I'll save again then. Hey, look at that. I saved and made it by. Unfortunately, that library is locked. Going north this way gets you caught. So you have to watch this guy. And when he's not facing you, like so, you have to run in there. Unfortunately, I got caught again. Luckily, I remembered to save this time. 
Here we are. And I run into a wall again. Okay, you do it one way, but then you have to do it the exact opposite way. And with that, you've made it past them all. But there's a slight problem. You haven't gotten to read all the books. Attention all sentries. Worship service will begin shortly. Please make your way to the sanctum at this time. That lets you go back without having to risk getting caught, I believe. But of course, that brings all the guards up here, so you have to fight them here. Still locked, there's no way there. Now, unfortunately, I never remember this puddle. We have to fight our way through several different trainers. Sanctum trainers. Benedictus Spiritus Septum. Welcome to the Holy Light Field. Fairy types and fairy type moves are usually buffed. Light based moves are usually buffed. Slashing moves are usually buffed. Any, or almost any legendary focus move is usually buffed. No, I will not end you. So, you want to go up here. I'm going to try to avoid those guys. There are several light shards around, and New World 2 shall be reborn. You have to type the number, add in the number of the page that it was. Unfortunately, I do not remember because I didn't read through any of them, because I am an idiot. So, I'm going to look up the solution off camera, and I'm going to do each one. Each time you get one right, it fills in the color on the gate, and once you get all four right, the gate opens. I'm going to look up the solution off camera, and we will continue on in the next episode after I finish this. Okay? So, next time on Pokemon Reborn, we're going to open up the Sanctum and do that. See you guys then. Check is signing out.